I'm Manon Rosticus. I started my PhD two years ago at EPFL in photonics in the laboratory of applied photonics devices. I studied uh, four years in France and I got a master in uh, optics and I did uh, one year and a half at EPFL, a second master in photonics too. During my master I had several uh, semester projects in labs and I found it really interesting and at the end of my master uh, one professor from EPFL contacted me and proposed uh, several uh, thesis subjects and uh, I was interested in one so I said why not. <laughs> I'm developing an imaging device, a compact imaging device, to image uh, in 3D uh, cells, for example, and in high resolution. So the problem with cells is, is that uh, in light you cannot see them, so that's why we need uh, what we call the phase of the cells. So my technique can uh, recover this phase, and so we have access to an image high resolution of the cells without staining it. The advantage of my device is that it's really cheap and really compact, so we can imagine putting it in a, in a sales incubator. So sales incubators are boxes in which you grow cells, so you have a certain temperature, certain gases inside to make them grow well. So for example, you can buy an expensive microscope uh, with the incubator integrated in it, but it's really expensive. Or uh, you have to remove the cell uh, from the box to observe them under a microscope. But then you cannot do this for a long time. So the idea is to use my uh, device to put it inside the cells incubator, because it's cheap and really uh, compact, uh, to see the cells inside the incubator. I'm using uh, holography, digital holography and analogic holography. The analogic holography is used to shape the illumination of the device. When I came to EPFL, I was surprised because it, it was way bigger than my university in France. In France, I come from uh, Institut d'Optique, which is really small because it's only 100 students per uh, year. So it's really small. <laughs> and uh, here it's huge and you have uh, really different uh, topics um, that the researchers are working on. That's really in interesting. And I was also surprised by the facilities because uh, you have access to everything almost. <laughs> you need something, you will find it. Someone in one lab has it, so that's really great. <laughs>